Hello again and welcome to episode 5 in our series about the energy retrofit of the old home next to the greenie flat. This week we'll look at how we replace these old single glazed double hung wood framed windows with the same windows that we used in the greenie flat which are double glazed aluminium framed windows. We chose aluminium frames because they're cost effective and long lasting with very little maintenance required. So the first step in replacing these windows is to strip out the old frames. And here you can see George and Daniel pulling out all the parts of the old windows that aren't necessary. Our goal here is to leave the old architraves and, and trim in place and just strip the windows back to the bare frame. This will save us a whole lot of work once the new windows are in because we won't have to put in new architraves or touch the interior plaster inside the house. So now they've got a clear opening, uh, they're just cleaning it up and putting in some blocks uh, and screwing it back to the timber stud frames to reinforce the frame of the window. And here you see from the inside they've got uh, a clear opening now ready to put the new window in. So at this point we're really hoping for two things. One is that we uh, measured the opening size correctly and the other is that the window manufacturers, which in this case is Stegbar, uh, made the windows the right size and thankfully the window fits perfectly. So instead of the old double hung windows we're using casement windows which are hinged at the side and we're using those because they seal much better than double hung or sliding windows. On the north side we use clear glass because it lets in more heat in the winter and on the other three orientations we use low E glass because it insulates better. Once the window is held in place on the outside we use these shims to align it on the inside, make sure it's plumb and square. We screw it in place to make sure that it stays where we put it. And once it's securely fastened in place, then we uh, just come along and cut the shims off. And then we attach a small piece of trim to cover the gap between the new window and the old architrave. And that pretty much completes the interior part of the job. We just need to uh, fill the nail holes and run a bit of no more gaps around and then we'll be ready to repaint the inside of the windows and there's the finished product from the from the inside then on the outside we just need to insulate the space where the old lead weights used to hang and uh, foam around the, the space between the window and the frame to air seal the window and that completes the installation of the new window and we're ready to start recladding the outside of the house. Thanks for watching once again and visit greenieflat.com.au for more information about the project.